Hi everybody, my name is Morteza and you are watching one of my videos about Visual Studio. In this video, let's very quickly talk about one of the very beautiful features of Visual Studio. So, you know, uh, writing programs and software these days, uh, it, it has become really, uh, you know, easy because there are a lot of capabilities in an IDE like Visual Studio which can help you to write your code uh, precisely without uh, typing errors and uh, so forth. So in, in Visual Studio, we've got something called IntelliSense. It helps you to construct your method calls, for example, or write your code. All you have to do to bring up this IntelliSense is to press Control Space. But I'm not going to talk about IntelliSense. I'm going to talk about something very specific uh, about IntelliSense. So let, let me... Uh, Give you an example. Suppose I want to uh, call a method console lat right line right. So for this method, I've got different overloads and overloads. Uh, I'm going to talk about overloads in my uh, object oriented programming in C sharp course. Uh, overloads are different uh, signatures of a method uh, by different parameters uh, for getting. Uh, you, you know this. IntelliSense shows up the moment you type a console that right line, for example, or any other method, and you put the first parenthesis. And here I've got two out of 19. So this console that right line has 19 overloads or 19 different versions with different parameters. For example, the first version uh, takes no parameters, the second one takes a bool, the next a character, the next one an array of characters and so on. So for navigating to the, uh, the, between these different signatures, I can use my arrow keys on my keyboard, down or up. This really helps me to code more effectively if I can just get away from my mouse. And then uh, I, I get kind of a you know description about this method. Write the current line terminator to be a standard output stream. Or, for example, for this part, for this one, uh, for example, this one takes a string, really easy. It says write the specified string value followed by the current line terminator to be a standard output stream. And for each uh, parameter, I've got uh, some kind of a tip. It says value, the value to write, and it is, of course, of type string. And if I go to the next one, for example, I've got string format. And then when I press, this one is format, a composite format uh, string, C remarks. And then when I put uh, a comma here, it goes to the next parameter. It says an object to write using format. So for each parameter, I've got some kind of a tip. And for the whole method, I've got a description and I've got the method signature. This overload accepts a string and an object. So using IntelliSense, when you want to construct your method calls, it, it, it is really helpful. It, it helps you make uh, less mistakes, fewer mistakes, and it helps you to write your code more rapidly. So thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel to watch all of my free videos about software development uh, with Visual Studio and .NET. Thanks.